I have come to realize on Shamba Shape Up that farmers never just have one problem. Often, there are many because problems are linked. I have asked James Mathenge from Sigenta to come and tell us about Mavuno Zaidi. It's a program that supports farmers across the whole production cycle, from getting microfinance for seeds and inputs, through to farming advice and training, right up to finding markets. Now, Mr. Mathenge, mm. if our farmer here wants to plant, uh, would you like to plant tomatoes? Yes. Let's, let's say he wants to plant tomatoes. Okay. And he comes to you okay. and wants to use Mavuno Zaidi okay. package. Okay. How do you start him off? So we, first of all, introduce you to a financial partner we are working with. Okay. Yeah. Because for a farmer to be successful, okay. uh, he or she has to acquire quality inputs. Yes. Yes. And quality inputs are expensive. Okay. That financial partner has got a tailored package, which enables this farmer, first of all, to grow that crop, okay. and then start repaying that loan from what you're selling from your, your yeah. crop. And this is essentially what we refer to as crop-based uh, financing. Take for instance, how long does it take for a crop of tomato to, to mature? Three months. Three months. Yeah. You'll be required to start servicing that package, that drone, from the fourth month, and it can be spread out uh, for a period of, up to a period of 12 months, depending on the terms of that financial partner. Okay. Oh. So once that has been established, mm. how do you work hand in hand with the farmer? That's when we start now with this farmer, like from nursery management, general crop husbandry, that is identification and management of disease and pests. Mm -hmm. So uh, we do advise farmers on which products to use and how to alternate, so that to avoid a scenario whereby there we have diseases uh, in his crop, and then linkages to end market. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's awesome. Mabuno Zaid is awesome. Yeah. So we start with our farm right from the nursery up to, to the market. Uh -huh. Yeah. Let's go to the markets. How do you link him with the market? Um, in Mabuno Zaid, we have uh, established a database of buyers who uptake various uh, products from farmers, depending on the volumes uh, that farmer is producing. Uh -huh. Yeah. So, Evans, yes. do you want to grow tomatoes using Mabuno Zaid? Yes, of course. All right. Right now, James is taking us through one of the key parts of Mavuno Zaidi, training. We're going to learn how to make a tomato nursery, and the first thing we need is a rack. This is the rack which this farmer can use uh, to press his seed trays on, and this rack has to be like one meter from the ground to avoid splashes from the ground because soil has got a lot of fungal or even viral diseases. The next step now is to press the media into the germinating tray. Mm -hmm. So this is what we use to germinate our seeds. It has got all the nutrients and it has also been screened against all diseases. You just press it gently. You don't press to avoid candling, which will reduce air spaces, which can affect germination uh, of our seeds. After that has been done, our next step is to press now seeds, one seed per hole. Which variety are we planting today? Uh, this is uh, Kilele F1 from yeah. Sigenta. Remember farmers, always use gloves when handling seeds to stop contamination. You just press one seed per hole. So what's the next step now that our seeds are on the tray? Now the next step is for us to cover these seeds. Cover lightly with the planting media, then water from a clean knapsack. If you are spraying, yes. do not use high pressure because high pressure will also aid in uncovering of those things. Okay. Next, cover with a bag to keep off insects. How can I know they have germinated? Most of the time they will take like five to seven days to germinate. Okay. So once they have germinated, that's when you come and remove the mulch and you leave that seed tray open. The most important thing for you to note is keep on checking on water levels because if that medium dries up, that seed will perish. Tomatoes has a lot of money. I have also decided I will venture into that farming business. 